So today we're going to show you the differences between the build configurations in Visual Studio. So here we just have a simple blink sketch for the Arduino Uno and we've got it set to release build configuration. So this is the same as the Arduino IDE essentially. So we, if we just build our program we can see it's coming out 924 bytes in this scenario. So if we just nip over to the Arduino IDE and then build exactly the same sketch for the same board we get unsurprisingly exactly the same number of bytes consumed. Don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel if you would like this video and to see further updates and videos. So if we just go back to Visual Studio and we change over to the debug configuration and build again we'll see that the size grows due to extra information that's compiled. So it's gone up slightly to 1032 bytes. And just to show the differences with the USB serial debugger, if we go and enable the serial debugger and then just build the sketch, we'll see that the size grows again as additional code and headers are included to enable the serial debugger to work with your sketch. So as you can see that's now risen by another 2000 or so bytes to 3278 so it's consumed quite a bit more space and as you add more breakpoints and trace points to your sketch so here we've just added another four this will also increase the size of the final program so do bear this in mind if you're running low on space on your chip 